If you don't know him, you better get to know him and I mean that, okay? <laughs> Not him making fun of me. <laughs> I am a child of the king. So you just better get on back to hell where you belong and leave me alone. No, did y'all already give all the free donuts out? Cause Satan been trying to creep into my life today. And let me tell you what, Satan, you ain't welcome here. It ain't no room in the end. Is this camera on me? This is stupid, guys. Whew. And I honestly can't take it. I can't take it, I can't take it, I can't take it. Johnny Jose, Santa Bay. Johnny Jose, hurry, hurry, hurry. Johnny Jose, Nick, make me wait all year for the 12 months of Christmas screaming, ho, ho, ho. Side down my chin. It's the most beautiful time of the year. Lights fill the streets, spreading so much cheer. I should be playing in the winter snow. I'ma be under the mistletoe I don't wanna miss out on the holiday But I can't stop staring at your face I should be playing in the winter snow I'ma be under the mistletoe Welcome back to Vlogmas. Y'all, filming Vlogmas videos ahead of time gets a little confusing because I'm like, girl, which day are you on? But anyway, make sure you subscribe. If you have not subscribed by now, then girl, what's the issue, okay? Because I know you love it here. So go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Let's get in a committed relationship. Yeah. So today, y'all, um, as you saw, I already did my walk this morning and um, I went by Target to get a couple necessities because your girl was running low on toothpaste and soap. So um, I just went and picked up some necessities and I made it out of Target without getting outside of myself. OK, so let me show you all what I got. I got I got toothpaste. I got toothpaste for myself. This is the Crest 3D White in the, y'all, I'm trying to use cinematic mode on my phone to see how that looks, but it's getting a little confused with focusing. But um, this is the flavor I got, Arctic Fresh. I like the Crest 3D White. That's the only toothpaste I really rock with for myself. So I switch up on the different flavors, but I got Arctic Fresh today. And then I also got Ryder, some more toothpaste. This is the only brand that I use for him. And this is the flavor that he likes for the most part. Is it gonna focus? Y'all. So, <laughs> by the time this video goes out, uh, hopefully a situation will be resolved with my camera. But um, if you're all caught up, like if you're not new here, then you saw that my camera broke a few weeks ago. Well, in real time, it broke a few days ago, but by the time this video goes out, it will have been a couple weeks ago. So, at this point, currently, as I'm filming this, I don't know what the outcome is with my camera. They still have not reached out to me um, to tell me, you know, whether, you know, what the estimate is to get it fixed. So, at this current moment, I still don't know what's T on my camera. Um, yeah, so... <sighs> I, and y'all, why was I looking for my phone? I was sitting there looking. Y'all know y'all saw me looking down. I was looking on the counter trying to find my phone. Girl, you vlogging on your phone. Girl. Anyway, they still have not called me. 
is my point. I was looking to see if I had a missed call, but my phone is on loud and it's right here in my face, girl. Um, I also got some soap. Your girl was out of soap. So here we are. I got Dove Gentle Exfoliating Soap. Um, I really like the bars in this scent, but they didn't have the smaller pack of the bars and I wanted a body wash and a small pack of bars. So I got the classic, the original, I got the original set of bars. Girl, if you'll focus, see, this is my first time using cinematic to vlog, but um, I got the original scent in the bars. So that's all I got, y'all. Let's see how much that was. The total came to $20.25 because I did have 82 cents worth of earnings in my Target Circle. So girl, download the Target, the Target app and get your Target points, okay? And so, and I had a coupon on the soap. The body wash was $1.50 off. So they didn't have no gift card promo right now for the soap, which I was upset about. But anyway, um, yeah, so that's all I got from Target. And um, I'm not going to let me put it in my stash of classy bags because y'all know how we do. But I am about to... Y'all, I apologize for looking such a mess right now. I still don't know what's going on with my forehead. Like, now it's just a big dark spot, which is annoying because I've been working hard to clear my skin and to brighten my skin back up from all these dark marks. And now I got a dark mark that wasn't even from acne. Girl, I don't know what that was. But anyway, um, I know I look a mess right now. But y'all bear with me because... So I'm just trying to get into this quality, like... Y'all let me know how you feel about the iPhone quality in cinematic mode for vlogging. Um, right now, it's looking okay. It's looking pretty good right now. And I don't even have an extra light on. I just have, like, the lights on in the kitchen and living room. But anyway, um, what was I about to say? Oh, I know I look a mess right now. And it won't be for long. I'm bleaching my hair today. So we're going back blonde today. We're going back platinum. I do need to wash my hair though because I've been wearing wigs. And so I have like, you know, even spray and wig glue and stuff trapped up in my hairline. So I do need to wash that glue out so the bleach can take the right way. Because if you are familiar with like wigs and like bleaching knots and stuff and coloring wigs, People be spraying like gots to be spray and wig spray on the lace to protect the lace because bleach and um, hair color will not take through like glue and spray and stuff and hairspray. So if I just try to bleach my hair like this, the rim of my hair, my hairline will still be black and everything else will bleach. So I have to wash this glue out of my hair um, and then we're going to get into the bleaching process now. I'm gonna show y'all some behind the scenes in this vlog, but I am filming a separate video for bleaching my hair. Matter of fact, that reminds me, I need to plug up my camera battery just um, to make sure she's all good. Cause I honestly have not picked up this camera in a while. I don't even know if the battery is charged. Where is the camera? Oh, I put it in this drawer because Ryder was trying to mess with it the other day. Um, the battery might already be charged for real because I haven't used it in a while and I feel like I may have charged it recently. But I'm gonna put it on the charger to be on the safe side and I have to find the charger. I really could use an extra battery for this camera too, but this one doesn't die as quick. Yeah, I don't use this camera as much. We gotta find the charger. I'm gonna use my Canon to film my blonde hair when I'm bleaching. And I'm gonna use, see, look at how crazy that got when I got in the dark. The quality gets really bad in the dark. Girl, what? Let's put you back in the light. Let's keep you in the light, okay? Um, I'm gonna use y'all, I'm gonna use my phone. To show y'all behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna take y'all with me. Y'all, I'm so hurt because Krispy Kreme was giving away free donuts today to the first 500 people, and I was supposed to go right after I dropped Ryder off so I could go get my free donuts, but I forgot, and I didn't remember till like 
11 o'clock and I'm like to be sure they've already had 500 people coming in for that by now because they open at 6 a.m. so I'm like I'm not gonna drive all the way over there for donuts that they're not gonna give me for free because um I only wanted them if they were free I didn't want to buy donuts I wanted a free pack of donuts and um where's my camera charger and um I thought about calling and be like, you know, did y'all already give all the free donuts out? But I know good and well they're going to tell me yes on the phone because they ain't going to want no more people to come up there and get free donuts. But they probably maybe really haven't. But it's like 20 minutes away and I don't want to drive 20 minutes to get disappointed. You know what I'm saying? If it was like 10 minutes, if they was like around the corner, you know, in my part of town, then I would go and give it a, try, give it a shot. But I have a feeling I'm gonna drive 20 minutes and be pissed off. So, y'all, I don't know where my battery charger is. I'm gonna get serious and try to find this real quick. And I'm gonna holler at y'all later. I'm gonna call y'all back when we're about to get started bleaching and all the things. Um, hold on, BRB. I was upset because our son once again put his life on the line, and our daughter. Or could it be that you have lied to me about the pregnancy you caught? So the cookies were good for the most part um i just overcooked them for like two minutes from my liking like i like my cookies a little bit raw <laughs> when i take them out the oven and then i let them sit there for a couple minutes and kind of like finish up outside of the oven so i left them in there for like probably two minutes too long but they were good i can see where i can see where tiktok was going with it but I definitely probably needed big marshmallows when I went to the store. I only had minis left, so probably just everybody seen the TikTok that I saw. But anyway. It is so dark right there. Oh my God. I think that's why I ended up having a light over here too to illuminate the back of me. I 
Now, I don't know why I'm acting like I had to go get the light out of my trunk or something. Like, girl, it's just in your office. This lens is so up close, y'all. Like, <laughs> there's no way I could vlog with this camera. Like, y'all wouldn't see anything. I think we're gonna roll with that, guys. So, let's get this show on the road. We're about to turn back to a platinum daddy. And I love that for us. Okay, cause y'all been eating me up in the comments, cussing me out, looking for the blonde. Hey girl, I get it because I've been missing her too. So, but this one's gonna lose my head, but yeah. I think I'm gonna take a break from y'all right quick so I can film a reel on my phone. So I'll see y'all in a second. Let me just tell y'all my testimony right quick. I still got bleach in my head. I'm about to wash it out, but I'm not a matter of breath because I've been praising the Lord, okay? <laughs> Let me just tell y'all my testimony real quick. So I don't think my hair is gonna be done by the time I have to go get my son. And it's definitely not gonna be styled. Like, I think it's still gonna be a little yellow. And I'm not gonna have time to style it and dry it. So I need a hat. I was looking for my Ivy Park hat because I'm like, that's a presentable hat. Like I could put on it to look ahead and I got to run some errands when I pick Ryder up. So I was looking for my bucket hat, couldn't find it. I'm searching everywhere. I said, Lord, I need your help. Lord, I need your help. I need to find this hat, Lord. I need your help. I called on his name and I asked for his help. And girl, I kept digging a little bit. And what, what popped out of me? that buggy hat because i asked my lord for help okay y'all better if you don't know him, you better get to know him and i mean that okay because just something as simple as that as simple as that that y'all might not think is a big deal that was a big deal to me because i literally was panicking to try to find that hat because i have to put something on my head when i go get my son because i can't go with just my hair all over my head I needed to find that hat and I called on the Lord and he came through for me. And I know that may sound small to y'all. That may sound like, girl, it ain't that deep to y'all, but that was deep to me because I literally called on him, asked him for help. And not even 30 seconds later, I found that hat. So if that don't tell you, you better get to know him. <laughs> I know it was simple, but it was, it was huge to me. Okay, that's all I had to say. Now, let's go wash this bleach out. Ah, thank you, Lord. Yo. <sighs> Why do these people hate me and my baby so bad? Like, they're literally threatening to evict me <laughs> because of my baby. <laughs> Y'all, this is so frustrating because I literally am doing everything I can. <laughs> everything I can as a parent and <laughs> it ain't nothing else I can do like <laughs> not him making fun of me <laughs> oh mommy, my god mommy, yes baby we're going to get a bat we're going to go get a bat mommy is not concerned revenge <laughs> but y'all I literally got a notice on my door today telling me basically you know same old stuff from my old complex that there's been excessive noise complaints and the noise is deemed excessive and I gotta have a conversation with leasing and all this you know so I go in there and I have the conversation it's the same lady as last time because I moved to a sister property y'all like they're owned by the same people oh, same leasing yeah. office agent same everything oh, so um mommy, yes baby the mermaids was oh no and so i go have the conversation and He's basically saying. the neighbor has been recording Ryder and he, um been sending the recordings of him he, jumping around he, and stuff and he, 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 she's basically saying he, he, like oh, yeah. i need to either move or she's got to get lawyers involved and i'm just like y'all what do y'all want from me like i get it i get it because he does get loud he does i know that mommy 
what do you want me to do? Mom, like, yes, baby. You don't want to see the pictures. I know. But, like, what do y'all want me to do? Like, she was like, well, have you tried to tell him to stop? Girl, if you don't, girl, duh. Like, that was the stupid thing to say, guys. Like, is this camera on me? This is stupid, guys. Like, make it make sense. Like, of course I tell him to stop jumping. Yeah, I do not sit there and encourage him to jump off of things. But Ryder, when he gets something in his mind that excites him, He's very repetitive. So, me trying to get him to stop is just going to egg him on half the time, guys. Like, so, of course I tell him to stop. But it backfires. And it makes him do it more. So, I don't know. I don't know what y'all want me to do. Like, I'm not putting my kid up for adoption. Like, what do you want me to do, guys? Like, And they're like, well, you can move to another unit. I paid over a thousand dollars what was it a thousand it was a lot of money i paid a lot of money to get movers to move my stuff basically across the street from one complex to the next i paid a lot of money i don't intend to pay that kind of money again until this lease is up and it's time for me to move on to my dream apartment guys like i i'm not coming out of pocket for movers because someone is uncomfortable with my son being himself. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I can't and I'm not. Okay? I can't and I won't. So, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> and then, I call because my camera, the camera people still have not called me to notify me about my camera so i'm like well they said it would only take a day so i called they said it's gonna be 280 dollars i don't want to give them 280 dollars what a day guys i'm just like can they even do that can they even evict me because of my child like is that even legal am i can i get a can i sue them like I'm just so over this so over this cause like my thing is look it's a Monday evening it's after 5 o'clock and Ryder's not even home Ryder ain't been home since 8.30 this morning well 8, 8 o'clock so he hasn't made no noise all day today for that lady to be complaining about so count your blessings girl You all you gotta do is deal with Saturday and Sunday and it's not even all day long. Ryder is an iPad kid. Ryder likes to sit on the iPad. So for the most of the day, he's sitting down, guys. Like, so a couple hours out of the day, I hate to break it to you, but that's not a big deal. Like, I don't even know if this is going to be in the vlog because I'm embarrassed. Girl, let me go to this grocery store because my baby don't got no snacks for lunch tomorrow. Well, he do. He do, but he don't got no fruit. My baby needs some fruit. So let's go. And we going to Chick-fil-A tonight because are we, girl? I don't know. I took out chicken to cook, but they done turned my nerves up. And now, I don't think I got it in me to cook. I don't know. y'all so my scalp is burning so bad um i can't even really think straight um i know the last time y'all saw me i was a mess and i apologize i deeply apologize okay if that clip even goes into the vlog oh i can't even think straight my hair is burning so bad oh it literally hurts like my scalp is on fire this is my third round of bleach today and I honestly can't take it. I can't take it, I can't take it, I can't take it. Y'all, 
y'all it literally hurts like it's gosh it hurts i can't take it i gotta wash this out oh i can't take it oh i can't take it oh i can't take it this is the same thing i said last time about a tough through it but girl ooh, 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 i literally cannot take it ooh, i cannot take it So y'all, I washed the bleach out and my head feels so much better. Like it literally felt like people were throwing bricks in my head. Like it literally felt like somebody lit a match. Matter of fact, they they hit they took some gasoline on my head and then lit a match. Like, oh my god, it felt like my scalp was ripping and peeling from the inside out. But that's a con to this bleach because my other bleach that I use do not do that. This is what I'm using, Blonde Solutions, and it's only 20 volume developers, so I feel like it shouldn't even be doing that because I have used 30 and 40 volume developer three times in a row before and it didn't do that. When I use my favorite brand, let me show y'all. When I use this, girl, I don't experience no burning like no burning and so i'm out of my bleach in this brand i only have a little developer but this stuff burnt my ass so bad so right now i put some purple shampoo in it because it was only the bleach went in there for i don't even think it was five minutes friend so it really didn't have a chance to really do much lifting so i just put some more purple shampoo in here to try to um further tone it and this is honestly giving me the vibe of what I would look like with lavender hair because I thought of dyeing my hair lavender um for like a YouTube video so this is what I would look like I guess so not bad not bad but it would definitely be temporary so I'm gonna let this sit in here for a little bit and then I'm gonna wash that out Oh, did I tell y'all? I think I told y'all, but I'm pretty sure I was crying. Y'all, they said it's going to be 280 to fix my camera. They said something about the power board. So, girl, whatever that means. But my thing is, I looked it up. And that body camera is 650 So, like, 280 after tax, we're looking at $300. So... Do y'all really think it's worth it to pay half the price of the body of the camera to fix it? Like, does that make sense? To me, that don't really make sense to put half the cost into fixing it. You know what I'm saying? To me, that don't really make sense. And like, when the new body is 600 and I've already had it for two years. Like, it feels like that doesn't really, you know, make good financial sense. And I can totally be wrong, like that may, I don't know. 
I just don't really think that makes sense. So I'm leaning more so towards not getting it fixed and just saving up for a new camera because my camera was two years old and they already have released, I believe, a couple new models since then. So I'm like, should I just save up for a newer model and definitely get the warranty next time? I'm definitely getting the warranty. I looked on Best Buy's website and the one that I had, like I said, is 650, but I believe the newer model, I think is a ZV E10. I think that one is like $800 for the body. And I'm like, the warranty, you can get a two year warranty or a four year warranty. Next time I'm definitely getting a warranty, definitely. And I'm just like, maybe it just makes more sense to save up for a new camera. Who knows how long that would take me because y'all like the priorities are at the top of the list and me and my wants are at the bottom of the list right now. So, I don't know how long it would take me to even get a new camera. So, we just praying, asking the Lord to bless us, okay? But I'm not going to let this stop me. Y'all see I'm vlogging on my phone. Vlogmas ain't going to stop. I'm gonna keep working. I'm gonna keep putting out content. I still have my Canon camera to do sit down videos and I'm gonna vlog on my phone. So I'm not gonna let this stop me. I'm not gonna let this stop me. Nothing's gonna stop me. Look, look me in my eyes. Nothing's gonna stop me. You hear me devil? Do, do you hear me Satan? Nothing's gonna stop me because Satan been trying to creep into my life today. And let me tell you what, Satan, you ain't welcome here. It ain't no room in the end. Okay, I belong to the Lord. Okay, do you hear me, Satan? <laughs> uh-uh. I belong to the Lord. I am a child of the King. So you just better get on back to hell where you belong and leave me alone. Because I am a child of the King. You hear me? Yeah. Big Daddy G. Not the little one. Period. I'm gonna go rinse this out now. Vapes been waiting Just as I recall that Your ass is still amazing Playing, baby Saying, baby Love it, shit, you know I'm pregnant So go ahead and drink up I'm so glad we got to link up Get to taking that off Taking that off me yeah. Cause I got the plug I made the call
Hear it up 